Hey guys, Ty the RV Guy here again with Denise, our parts manager, and this time we're whipping up a wicked dessert for you guys to try out. What are we doing today, Denise? Well, breakfast or dessert, uh, we're going to make a stuffed French toast. Gotcha. One of my favorite things uh, to make over the campfire. If you look over here, I got the, the hot iron heating up over the fire. Ty, what do you like to call this thing? Um, I believe my grandma liked to call it a bush pie maker. Bush pie maker, which <laughs> we can also make stuffed French toast with. Absolutely. So, um, a few ingredients you're going to need for this uh, dessert or breakfast first thing in the morning. You're going to need three eggs, a little bit of vanilla, some cinnamon, some cream. That's going to be your egg mixture for the French toast. And I've got some uh, icing sugar and berries and maple syrup to put on top when we're all finished. That's what the finished product is gonna look like when we're finished. Can I eat this for right now? You can have that one right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'll run the camera for a while. All right, so this is what we're gonna do. We bought some uh, Texas toast. Time gonna get you to Don't cut burn it. the uh, edges off of that toast. It fits a little bit nicer into our bush pie maker. Sure thing, well, I can do that. you're doing that, I'm gonna whip up the French toast. Perfect. And uh, I'm Mi gonna take that shell out Mitch, of there. would you like to eat the crusts? <laughs> I'm okay, Tyler. Thank you. <laughs> so we're just gonna whip those three eggs up. We're gonna add a little bit of cream into there. A little bit of vanilla. A little bit of cinnamon and last but not least a little bit of white sugar because we all have a sweet tooth absolutely once that egg mixture is all good to go I'm gonna grab our little sandwich maker get that a little hot I'm just gonna put a touch of oil so we don't get any sticking when we put the French toast pieces on. Once we're done that, Ty, do you want to put the bread into the French toast mixture? Of course I can. Perfect, just Once like that. Once that's good, yeah. Throw right. it on one side there. Gotcha. There we go. It's sizzling. Same with the other one. Beautiful job. Now all we're gonna do, guys, the stuffing mixture is some mascarpone cheese. Kind of like a cream cheese, a little sweeter. We're gonna put some of that on the inside. This is what happens with your bush pie. Back over the fire. I would say you're going to be about a minute on each side. Awesome. To die for. Yeah. It looks delicious already. Yeah. This is the best part is actually watching it cook. Yeah. <laughs> Hanging out around the campfire. Absolutely. Yeah. In the morning or after dinner. Where would you get a device like that, Denise? We actually have them in my parts department here oh. at Rangeland RV. Yep. Awesome. Awesome. Along with all your uh, fire pokers and your weenie roasting sticks. Good. We have all that stuff in stock. Perfect. Oh, can you hear that? You can hear the sizzle now. Just going to give it one more little flip here. Oh yeah, you can really hear it going now. You can hear it now. <clears throat> perfect, perfect. And you said how long do we you cook I it usually think, for? I think about a 
minute on each side just so that that bread is nice and crispy on the outside and we've got okay. all the cheese melted through. So you're just going for that good little uh, uh -huh. golden brown and that kind of thing? Let's see how we did. Absolutely. I gotta be here for the unveiling. Let me try to squeeze Careful it there. Careful you don't burn your there you hand. Go. There we go. Oh, that looks oh. perfect, Denise. It's almost like a big ravioli. Like it ravioli. was meant to be, guys. Wow. So like I said, we're just gonna scoop that out of our bush pie maker. There you go. <laughs> oh yeah. Wow, that looks amazing. Add some strawberries and raspberries or whatever kind of fruit you want. You could put some chocolate drizzle on there if you felt like it. I feel like it. <laughs> Top her off with some icing sugar. And, and right in little... here we've got some maple syrup. Drizzle that over the top. If you wanted to make this like an adult dessert, is there something that you could do? I think you could put some Baileys in the middle oh. with oh. the mascarpone cheese. Oh. And then you're definitely having adult dessert. Oh, that would be I amazing. Or you could start the morning off with it as well, right? Yeah. With some <laughs> coffee. Um, I don't have a fork. Does anybody Mitch, have a Mitch, do you want to have a bite? Do you want to have a bite, Mitch? Oh, hey, guys. Go for it. Right in your hands. What are we doing? Go for it. Do it might be a little warm. It? might be a little warm. Here, do you want me to cut it? Uh, yes, please. Or here, Denise, before. you go ahead. You go ahead, Ty. Gotcha. All I'm right. Gonna find him a fork. All right. Let's. You want. You want some berries in there too? I'm assuming. Yeah. We'll try to get a little. That bit. looks amazing. Oh yeah. Ice and sugar on that. Oh. Get a fork for you, right? There, there we go. There we go. Okay. Take a bite of that. Let's see. It's probably not very good. <laughs> no, don't even. <laughs> I don't think anything we've made here at Cooking with Sluggy's been. Is it going to well be received? <laughs> Hey Tyler, you want, wow. to talk, want to talk about our new segment that's mm. going to be added to our YouTube channel? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so let's see. It. That new segment that's going to be added to our YouTube channel is Cooking with Sluggy. Cooking with Sluggy. <laughs> Sorry, I, I drew a blank there. <laughs> Parts manager during the day and uh, cook extraordinaire at night or on the weekends. Yeah, awesome. If absolutely. you guys want any of these recipes, please check us out at rangeland.com uh, right. or give me a shout and we'll get you emailed or text the recipes for all of our stuff we're doing. I'll awesome. put them up on the YouTube channel with the videos as well. I added them into the videos. Awesome. awesome. Perfect. Thanks again for, Thanks watching, for watching, guys. Happy camping.